I'm Joseph Ibuna Senior. I'm a horologist. I'm the inventor of 24 hours analog clock. I'm here to express my experiment inspiration based on this my invention. Talking about my new invention, the 24 hours analog clock, it is my own creative artwork in inventing the 12 hours analog clock with the motive of my imagination, perspective that drives me to explore the designing and creating a 24 hours analog clock against the 12 hours analog clock which we all know. Considering the fact, in a strict sense, it is a great innovative idea. This is my creative artwork, surely is essential. Although it happens that um, this is my first step, the second one is the transition from the required function to the result of its function. Um, which is to give a massive production had the sponsors come in we will have a pinpoint in the history this is an invention that will impact the world positively well however considering the fact in the past decades when the horologists and the scientists were conducting a research based on the 24 hours analog clock publicly known as a full day analog clock, it was written record that the analog clock cannot be able to carry out a full day clock and eat multifunction, such as day, date, month, and year. Due to this fact, it was later turned into a digital clock, and that's why you see a digital clock displayed. 24 hours and it multifunctions. But I have done my experiment and research based on this invention that will convince the world and my colleagues, the horologists, that it is possible due to my solid research and commitment to this project. I assure the fact that we can do it. I'm doing it and I've got it right. My Imagination lives. Success in life is not all about working so hard. It is all about working it right. It is not those who work so hard that enjoy the best of life. It is those who work on the right direction at the right time that have their ways to the top. And therefore, I have really given it all my time and resources to make it right. In making a successful remark, do not say after the best I could. Don't just try the best you could, but keep on trying once you get it right. Seeing that there is no honor for a done job. In respect of Thomas Edison, who tried 99 times, failed, but eventually got it right. At the last time, in his invention of electricity. Had he been, he stopped. He wouldn't have actualized his dreams. But because of compassion and solid tenacity, the whole scenario is now a story to tell. Right about today, the whole world still pays homage to Thomas Edison every time, everywhere, for his vision a mission. I have tried the best I could is a statement made for a man who do not have passion for his mission. When you have passion for your mission, you do not give up and you get it done. In the past centuries, when the 12 hours analog clock was invented into the world, ever since then, the horologists around the globe have been struggling so hard to meet up with 24 hours analog clock. Seeing that a day long for 24 hours and all their efforts comes to naught. But glory be to God for giving me the wisdom, the knowledge, the understanding to make it possible. You know, with ignorance or struggles. But with one excellent healing knowledge, freedom is made a maximum. This is a generation of freedom 
for the hologists around the globe. You know, you can't know what you're not born to know until he that knows it made it known to you. And that's why the horologist behind the industries has been struggling all these years without understanding what it takes to meet up with 24 hours analog clock. This is God given special wisdom. One wise, very carry word. God created things as of nature. Then he made man as well. God made man to do what? I listen deeply on this. This is one of the most important things we must reason about. Don't just live to live, but live for a purpose. Actually, man was made and endorsed with creativity inspirations. Perhaps man was made for two purposes. First and foremost, God made man to taste his artificial nature. Man was originally made as the artificial nature of God. For instance, he is God, we are humans. He is a mother, we are mothers. He is superior, we are supers. He is invisible, we are visible. He is the creator, we are the creatures. Basically, in the beginning, it was stated. And God said, let us make man in our own image, after our likeness. Our own image means our second impression, our artificial nature. Secondary, God made man to add more artificial values to his creations. Based on this fact in the scriptures, it is written, Ye are gods. Ye are gods means you are creators as well. And therefore, create your own values. And that's why the sons of men have never been tired of advancing creativities over the centuries. Considering the technological era, the advancement of technology, the living thing, innovating, measure but few. These indications are the significance of adding artificial values to his creations. I really have a lot to say about this, but pardon me for now. Now back to my statement. This is my creative artwork, innovative idea. The 24 hours analog clock is a great deal. I mean, big market. God assured me when he gave me the idea in 2009 that once this 24 hours analog clock is being given to a massive production, it will binge the 12 hours analog clock forever. For this is the world awaiting invention in the timepiece world. More so, I'm a positive thinker and also a creative ideologist. I think on possibilities. When you think you'll be great, believe you'll be great, then great ideas that will make you great will come your way. Just easy as ABCD. In addition to my statement, whatever God gives you, He expects you to add more value to it in order to make it valuable. Be it an idea, gift, money, children, or whatsoever. He expects you to develop it to the level of acceptance, to the level of appreciation, to the level of visual reality. I mean to the level of standard, where people can see it and say, wow, this is a well done job. Whatever God gives you is a raw material for success and therefore trade with it. Moreover, one thing you must understand in life is that 
no great impact come by self ability you must allow people to come in and share their ideas more so experience we exploit the ideas for effectiveness in one area or the other even in the beginning it was stated and god said let us even god himself didn't do it alone how much more we humans and that is the beginning examples that god displayed to mankind let us in whatever we are doing let us let us is always the way to fulfillment together it is possible together it is done unity is the best team to win challenges cruzim the inspiration of this great innovative creative artwork and the engine plan came to me in 2009 and ever since then have been developing it to a level of virtual reality well however i am bold enough to take the steps of my destiny i am bold enough to believe in my dreams with inspiration and commitment back up with this vision i'm sure you are convinced to explore the 24 hours analog clock thanks for your time support and dedication let me make welcome the 24 hour analog clock to the universe